Sir, welcome. Good morning, sir. <laughs> A huge round of applause. Shri Kanjan Kumar Kanba, IPS, President of Police Centre. Inspection of the case, March Pass, Indira Community, Message and Declaration of Sports Queen, Special Case, Children Display Class 6 Videos, and Vote of Thanks to Moksha. It's a day to celebrate and share our participants. But it's also a time to remember that sport, above all, is about friendship, respect, and understanding. So without further ado, let's start the day with an invocation by Sister Claire, Vice Principal of St. John's High School. Let us listen and address letter of St. Paul the Corinthians, chapter 9, 24 to 26. Do you not know that in a race the runners all compete? but only one receives the prize. Run in a way that you may win it. At last, exercise that control in all things. They do it to receive a very pure gift, but leave an imperishable one. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, as we gather together today to mark the beginning of our address God's meet, we come before you with grateful hearts. We thank you for the gift of health, strength, and the ability to compete. Trusting in the words of Philippians 4.13, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. We ask your divine presence to be with us as we embark on these days of competition and comradeship. Lord, guide us as we complete these days. May we strive for excellence, not just for profit, but for the joy of pushing our limits and participating in friendly competition. Grant us sportsmanship that we may win with humility and lose with grace. May our bodies be strong and our spirits high. May we remember that the true victory lies in building teamwork, fostering friendships and developing a spirit of perseverance. Let the days of our sports meet keep us safe from all injury and fill our hearts with joy. May this day be reflection of your glory and grace, and may we glorify you in all we do. We make this prayer to Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you, Sister. Let's all put our hands together for our friends to come. Reverend Father, may we join for the first of our God. Good morning, Father. Honorable guests, sisters, teachers, and to my dear students. It gives me immense pleasure to welcome all of you to the annual sports meet of St. John High Secondary School, Pilar Sun. I would like to take this opportunity to welcome our special guest of the day, Colonel Miles Bankworth, CEO 29, Asan Rifles PRC. Then I would like to serve the happy accepted the invitation and today his willingness to be with us for his love for the students. May I request, sir, to stand up and to accept a small token of love from St. John Harvey.
Thank you, sir. I would like to welcome our guest of honor, Sri Kanchan Kumar Kanpal, IPS, Superintendent of Police, Pakistan. I have contacted him only to form. But sir was so gracious to accept our invitation and to be present amidst us. We are very happy that sir is present among us. I am sure the thoughts and the motivation sir will be given to you when you are in the days to come in your heart. May I request you to serve this kindly stand up and to accept this small gesture of love from the journey. Thank you, sir. Sir, Sri N. Y. Chuba, affectionately we call him Baba N. Y. Chuba. He is our board, school board managing member. We are very happy, and St. John family is indeed proud to welcome you today into this institution as the tribal head namely President of CKS. Sir, you have been with us always in good times as well as in bad times of the school. Today we are extremely happy that you are present among us. We would like to give you a small token of appreciation from St. John's School. May I request you kindly stand up. Thank you, Baba. I also would like to welcome all the members of school management who are present here, sector leaders, ward leaders, head of the schools, Piansang village leaders and representatives from Alumni Association, as well as all our faculty members, staff, and you, my dear students, for this great event of the school. Sports are important days on the calendar of St. John Higher Secondary School. It is a day when students are freed from the classroom learning to compete themselves in sports event. It is a day when red faces and perspirations and t-shirts and shorts are the order of the day. It is also a day to smile and to cheer and overall all to show the sportsmanship and making memories. Wish you all, all a great time ahead. Once again, hearty welcome to one and all. Wish you all my friends who are present here a happy holy. Thank you and God bless you. Thank you, Father, for your warm words of welcome. May we now request our esteemed guest, Colonel Nilesh Bharadwaj, Commandant 29 Nelson Rifle, Twin Sound, to hoist the pride of our school, our school flag.
wickedness and idleness and be also free from sin and be also free from sin. Come on, comrades, come along. St. John's School, let's come along. We are youngsters of St. John's School, you can tell it from our smile. For God, for our motherland, forward marches, come along. Courage, comrades, to it, we must make a better road to live. Make a better road to live. Come on, comrades, come along. St. John's School, let's come along. We are youngsters of St. John's School, you can tell it from our smile. With our football study beer, worthy and sing is for simply. Make us worthy citizens of our motherland, great and dear. Our motherland, great and dear. Come on, comrades, come along. St. John's School, let's come along. We are youngsters of St. John's School, you can tell it from our smile. Thank you, sir. May our fleet keep soaring high and our nation keep on prospering to great heights. Now it's time to light the Olympic torch, which ignites the passion of sporting spirit. The flame represents the endeavor of protection and struggle for victory. The flame symbolizes the light of spirit, knowledge, and life. The first torch bearer of Olympic flame is Sangbo of Blue House. Now the torch is passed on to Hegila of Yellow House. Next, it is handed over to Hong Kong of Red House. Finally, the torch is handed over to Lang Bong of Green House. The flame of peace and harmony is now lit in our school premises and may this light glow to remove darkness in the lives of all. Now we have oath taking, so may we request all the students to stand at their respective places and take a pledge to maintain fair play, respect, integrity and responsibility. We swear that we will take part in our school annual sports and camps mid 2024 in fair competition, respecting the rules and regulations which govern it. In the true spirit of sportsmanship, for the honor of our country, and for the glory of God. Let's now lend our ears to Sri Kanchan Kumar Kanbal, IPS SP, to sing for his words of encouragement. Uh, good morning, all of you. First of all, uh, respected CEO 29AR and his colleagues, uh, our guide and mentor, President CKS, respected principal of uh, uh, this school, all respected teachers, and my dear student. First of all, a big congratulation to all of you for organizing this uh, annual sports day. This is, I guess, my third time that I have been invited to this school by uh, Father CV. And because of, unfortunately, because of some personal or professional commitment, I couldn't come earlier. But this time I made promise that whatever may be the reason, whatever may be the circumstances, I am definitely going to come to uh, this school and I'll definitely attend this program. 
Today also we had one uh, very important meeting, all unit commanders meeting going on there in Dimapur. So I specially requested our ADG sir, sir, I just want to attend this program because it's been like three or four times that I always made commitment and then I somehow I had to skip the program. So today I send my subordinate staff to that unit commander meeting and I'm staying here because uh, to be very honest, I want to interact with all the school children also. And whenever I go to any school function, I was just discussing, uh, discussing with my parents also uh, before coming here, that whenever I go to any school function, it reminds me of my school days. Uh, I remember being a student and always thinking of one single sentence, that why this chief guest or why this spe special guest speech is this much lengthy? Why is not just saying thank you and just uh, get away from the stage and let us enjoy the uh, our sports or whatsoever be the program is. So I will not take much of our, your uh, your time, but as I discussed before coming here uh, with Father Sivi that I will just directly interact with students and I have a special request for, uh, from all the uh, student community and as you are torch bearer of our society, so, so I want few commitments from all of you. First and foremost thing is, I am not talking to you as a police chief of this district or as a police officer. I am talking to you and uh, a humble request from my side as an elder brother of all of you. Please stay away from any kind of drug addiction. As we all know that drug has become a maniac, it has penetrated our society and whenever I, <coughs> I go through the data, our police personnel, we are arresting a small uh, uh, school kids, teenagers, all those of uh, students of your age indulge in all those drug-related activities. They all are victim of this drug abuse. So from this stage, I request all of you and I want commitment from each one of you that you will not indulge in any kind of any activity that promotes uh, the uh, drug addiction in our society. So this is my basic uh, uh, humble request, not as a police, uh, as I told you, like uh, uh, being a police personnel, being a law enforcement, uh, law, law enforcement agency, it's my duty also. But as, a, as an elder brother, as an experienced person, I just want to make a humble request from all of you. Please stay away from drugs. It will... Uh, this is not at all good and it's a real evil in this society. Second thing, it's my uh, second year here in Twinsang and our students are very bright, okay? They are very good in, uh, in studies. But two, three things I find ki we should, uh, together we should work upon all of, uh, we should all work upon them. First thing is our focus on mathematics and science subject. I discussed this with some of your teachers in my personal sitting with them, that all those uh, big shot of examination like IIT, JE, NEET, uh, JRF or any other examination, uh, our esteemed colleagues are here from army background. So to get through all these examinations, like be it NDA, CDS or any uh, uh, prestigious examination, we need good command over mathematics and science subjects. So my humble request to all of you, because I can observe that uh, we all have this tendency to stay away from all those uh, subjects. So my humble request, as I discussed last time also, we will focus on these subjects and we'll make our society, our school, even our parents proud. Third thing, that is my request to your school authorities also, and to all of you also, focus and learn one computer language, be it C, be it C++, be it Java, Python, anything. So whosoever is your computer faculty here, if you want any kind of assistance from my side also, because I'm also an engineer uh, graduate, so if you need any kind of assistance, please let me know, but please try your student, uh, please uh, try and train your students in computer, uh, 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 activity, uh, in computer education and especially teach them at least one computer related, uh, one computer language because we all know that today's world is IT driven, information technology driven and if we don't know anything uh, with regard to computers, we will lag behind. So this is my humble request and a suggestion to all of you. 
and uh, especially it's a sports day so uh, to add upon I, I would like to say all of you that each one of you pick one sports and learn it properly and enjoy it properly okay be it any uh, any sports of your choice but try to uh, learn this because it will not only help you in the recreation but also help you uh, in uh, keeping you sh in shape and also it will teach you uh, discipline it will teach you team building and it will teach you a leadership quality so these all from my side lastly i would uh, uh, just say to all of you that school time is actually the basic molding time whatever we learn here whatever we uh, enjoy here whatever we experience here it uh, it shapes our life so at last few words from robert frost that woods are lovely dark and deep but i have promises to keep and miles to go before i see with this i'll conclude my speech here thank you very much and a big congratulation to all the school authorities for organizing organizing this program thank you very much thank you sir for your kind words and guidance may we now request our esteemed guest to do the honor of inspecting the different march pass contingents
March Pass is all about synchronization and teamwork. Marching in a contingent demands alertness and an unspoken coordination. The drum beat rolls, the band strikes up, and a high-pitched voice issues a command. The synchronized swing of arms and the touching feet there is something within us. We are extremely glad to introduce the NCC cadets and four distinctive houses, namely Blue House, Green House, Red House, and Yellow House, led by a submerged class of standard then as the parade commander. Here, the march begins.
Now, may we request our honorable guest, Colonel Nilesh Paradwaj, Commandant, 29 Assam Rifles, to insang for his message and to declare the annual sports meet open. Okay, good morning to all of you. I, Colonel Nilesh Bharadwaj, Commandant, 29 Assam Rifles, Twin Sang, solemnly declares that the annual sports and games meet of St. John's Higher Secondary School, Twin Sang, for the year 2024, open. Annual Sports Day, opening of Annual Sports Day. Uh, a beautiful message has already been given by SP of uh, Twin Sang. Uh, I would just like to say the uh, people of Nagaland, they have a natural ability to play sports. They are physically very, very fit. So since it is the opening of the sports day, I would like to give you a message that what SP Saab said, all of you must pick up at least one game and give it your heart and soul to it. People of Nagaland, whenever they play, they have an edge of physical fitness with them. They are natural sports person. So, you must play hard. It is always said that healthy mind lives in a healthy body. So if you are physically fit, if you are a good sports person, naturally you will have an edge in each and every field in the life. So this is my message to you. You must play hard, work hard, and grow up in life. Thank you.
Good morning to you all. I, Nokshang of Standard 12, on behalf of the St. Junians, stand here today as a proud and grateful student to express my heartfelt thanks to all those who have made this event possible. At the outset, I would like to start by thanking our principal, who have always been supportive of our initiatives and encouraged us to strive for excellence. In a special way, we would like to extend our gratitude to our Superintendent of Police and Commandant Assam Rifle for sending your personals who had untiringly trained the students for the March bus. My words of gratitude also goes to the trail teachers who had motivated the students and made the event colorful. I also wish to applaud all our dear teachers for extra mile you took in nurturing our talents. You have been instrumental in our growth and development. I would also like to express my appreciation to our case who are in our midst out of their busy schedules to grace this occasion. Your presence has added an extra spark to this event and made it even more special. Finally, I would like to thank each and every one of you present here for your support and participation in making this event a grand success. Your contributions have not gone unnoticed, and I'm grateful for all that you have done. In conclusion, I would like to say that this event would not have been possible without each and every one of you. Once again, on behalf of the school, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to one and all. Thank you. Thank you, Dermot, for your words of appreciation. As we reach the end of a dynamic and intense day, it's important to recognize that each athlete, irrespective of winning or losing, has shown incredible sportsman spirit. We close this ceremony on an inspirational note, hoping the memories and lessons of this sports day will motivate all of us to strive for excellence, not just in sports, but also in all walks of life. Thank you, one and all.
Thank <laughs> you.